Alright, this is a very, very, very simple guide, a little tutorial on how to use custom translations. Um, just a heads up, a note, uh, you cannot and you will not get banned for doing this. You are simply modifying and editing the translation files. You are not touching anything internal with Secret Laboratory, so you will be fine. Okay, so what you want to do is you want to go to my GitHub. I will have that in the description. Uh, you can go and read all this stuff. Um, to find a translation, you go into Menu, Translations, and you can see this other README. Um, I will definitely update this at the time of making this. This will probably be different when this video gets uploaded. Maybe, maybe not. Um, you can see all the translation menus I got. So for this video, I'm going to show you how to do the fiery menu, red menu. So I will always put a preview for what some of the uh, menus look like, just so you know what they look like, and I always have them inside of the folder. So uh, we're going to be doing a fiery red menu. You can even click in it, and you could read the other readme for this, which just more FAQ and how to install it. This video is just a video way of showing you how to install it. So come to the main page, go click the green button, highlight it, or the code, uh, code, code button, green code, bu green button that says code, uh, you click it, click downloaded zip, I already have it downloaded, I have it in my music folder, because why not, you want to extract the zip file, you want to go inside it, go inside that, menu translation, so we're doing this one, um, you can go to the preview and see these previews for it. Uh, basically, what we want is this folder right here. You don't need all the other stuff unless you want to do those other translations. Uh, you can come in here just to make sure we have all the translation files in here. So what you want to do is right-click and copy this folder. So you can cut or copy. I will, I'm just going to cut it. Then you want to come to Steam, search up SCP Secret Laboratory in your library. You can either right-click from here and click properties or do it right here. I'm going to do it right here. You're going to go to properties. Then inside this menu, you want to click local files, then browse. When you are inside of the game files, you want to open translations. Right click and paste the folder. I already have it here, so I'm going to replace. After doing that, you just want to simply launch the game. After launching the game and inside of the main menu, you want to navigate over to settings. Then inside of settings, you want to navigate to others at the end of the little tab thing. Then language this is where you select your custom translations that you download. So we are going to look for a fiery red menu, which is right here. Simply click it. It will refresh your main menu and boom, you got it. Cool little theme.